other bots in the warframe market that manipulate prices on some things i don't know if it's bots but i mean people can be bots you know like you know what i mean like people can stage things i've seen it but you can't really manipulate it that much so let's say for example ninja prime set you see how like the first person that's up on there is 70 platinum right then you look at the person underneath that 72 then it jumps to 74 75 76 you see how they're trying to just cut each other off to try to get the best pricing so they can get rid of whatever the hell it is if you see people with the same exact price back to back they could be bots or they could be people that are just trying to be competitive with each other and that's it like they're fine with waiting i've done that before where let's say for example i had the nezha prime set and i was trying to sell it i wouldn't settle for 70 platinum i would probably put it up to like 100 and i'll park it there if it takes days for it to sell i don't give a shit like i'm just gonna leave it up there and if somebody sends me a message and says hey i'm interested in the set i'll give it to them but i'm not gonna be a desperate asshole trying to po post it for the lowest price unless i need platinum right now but in this case i would never sell a prime a prime set like this for that low i just wouldn't of course there's people that also do trade chat i mean if you want to dick around with that you can but it's just too much of if it feels like the wild wild west on trade chat there's no way to truly tell like what's happening because like look at this i'm just going to show you like everything is fucking crazy on here night is prime look willing to sell night is prime for 100 platinum and Harl prime for 100 platinum let's look it up so nidus prime full set the lowest is 54 and then it goes to 55 55 58 59 60 you see what i mean like why would i buy it from that dude for 100 platinum when i could just go right here and start messaging these guys to see who's gonna sell it to me you know what i mean like why would you rip yourself off you could buy two Nidus's for the price of that 100. Now let's look at Haro Prime. See, that's what I'm saying all the time. Like, don't mess around with trade chat, like at all. Like, unless you're selling to people on trade chat, you want to rip people off, go for it. But you're only going to be taking advantage of new players that don't know about the Warframe market. 54 platinum for a Haro set. You see, here we go. Confirming the fucking thing. 60 platinum all the way down. That's a lot of 60 platinums. That could be a bunch of bots right there. It could be. So you got to message. Like what I would do is I would message the first person. If they don't get back to me or they say, oh, sold it or whatever. I like when people actually send me a message and say, hey, I sold it. Like that's good. Um, but if they didn't say anything it, within the first minute i'll move on to the second person send them a message and see if they still have it if they don't i'll jump straight to the end here and i'll message the last guy if they don't have it i'll go to the 65 and i'll just start with those and then i'll go to the last person i don't do this whole dicking around sending everybody one by one a message because if the first one is not going to answer then chances are likely that the second one and the third one and the fourth one is not going to answer either but that's just my thought process on it also you can kind of look at the reputation too sometimes that matters a lot of times it doesn't but sometimes it does so maybe this guy with the 511 or the 63 good reputations they'll probably get back to you or at least tell you if they sold it or something you know so you could look at that as well but yeah it's kind of whatever